how to beat the competition in the search engines by using the free Mozbar Chrome extension tool. Hi guys, it's Sam Day here from daytips.com helping serious entrepreneurs like you to boost sales to your products and services online. If you are a serious entrepreneur, then make sure you subscribe to this channel and click that bell notification button as well so you never miss a tip that could help you to boost your online earnings. So in this video, I'm speaking about one of my favorite SEO tools that will help you to beat your competition in the search engines. Now, if you've been subscribed to this channel for any length of time, I'm sure you would have heard me speak a lot about domain authority and how important it is to build a website that is authoritative and as a result, ranks well in Google. So authoritative sites are ranked from a scale of zero to 100. And that is actually a scale that a company called Moz uh, kind of came up with. And they actually have a tool that calculates the authority of websites in the search engines. And you can actually install this tool for free using Google Chrome. It's only available to my knowledge at the moment on Google Chrome. Um, as you can see, I've got their website up at the moment and I will leave a link to this website in the description down below as well. Uh, but essentially you can download this free Mozbar tool. And when you click the download button, it will take you through the steps of how to download it and install it on your Chrome um, web browser. So as you can see, I'm actually on Chrome as well. And up here is my little M and that is the Mozbar uh, for, for, from Moz. So that's the Mozbar Chrome tool that I've installed already. So because I've already installed it, all I have to do is log in. So I'm going to log into my account. Uh, you just set up yourself an email and a password, absolutely free. It's a great tool. And once you've logged in, at the moment it's not on because it's grayed out, but if I click on it, you will see that it turns blue and it tells me the page authority or the PA and the domain authority uh, DA of this particular page. So the page authority is how authoritative the, the web page I'm currently looking at is. And the domain authority tells me how authoritative that entire domain is. So I can see that this particular page of Mozbar has a PA of 64, but the entire domain authority for moz.com is um, 89. So I can actually use this as well in the search engine. So if I go to Google, I can type something in such as maybe, uh, let's say I type in tennis tips. Now, because I have the Chrome bar turned on at the moment, it's blue you can see that these search results, it gives me a page um, authority for the particular page that is ranking in search. And it also gives me a domain authority for this website as well. So if I go, for example, to bettingexpert.com, the page that is ranking in Google for the term tennis tips has a, has a page authority of 33, but the domain itself has a domain authority of 59. So that is a really great insight for me. And also I can actually see that the, the, the um, pages underneath it. So this one has a page authority of 21. This is 29, this is 28, this is 24. So you can kind of see a little bit of a trend here. It's within the twenties and it, as you get lower, it's actually in the forties, uh, the page authorities that are actually ranking for this particular keyword. So I can use this to my knowledge if I wanted to create a page on my website that was ranking for uh, tennis tips, then I know that I should try and have a page authority of at least in the twenties kind of region for me to have a, the best possible chance of ranking for that particular keyword. And this is also a great way for me to look at my competition and see what their domain authority is as well. So if I click on this website, I can take a deeper look at their page, uh, different pages on their site and see what the page authority is and domain authority is. I can also utilize this tool to look at my own website as well. Check my domain authority and check my page authority as well for different pages. This is a great way to keep an eye on what your page authority is and what your domain authority is, as well as looking at your competition as well. Again, it's a tool that's absolutely free and it could really help to improve your research when it comes to what keywords you want to rank for and how well your competition is doing in terms of search and what things they're doing that you're not doing. And, you know, just to kind of keep an eye on what's going on. So again, I'll leave 
a link in the description down below to the Moz Bar Chrome extension tool. It's only available on uh, Chrome web browsers to my knowledge at the moment. So if you're not using Chrome, you might want to install Chrome so you can make use of the tool. Um, but yeah, I really do hope that this video brought you value. Make sure you go and install the tool, um, especially if you're trying to do search engine optimization and rank for competitive keywords. This tool will help you to gain some insights. But if this video did help you out, then please click the like button down below and make sure you share this video with a friend. If you have any additional questions or comments, then leave them for me in the comment section. But until next time, watch some of my other great videos. Make sure you subscribe to this channel for more awesome business related content. I also have the formula, which is absolutely free and it's gonna teach you how to generate leads and sales to your business online. A copy of it is behind me. I'll also leave a copy somewhere on this screen. So make sure you download that absolutely free. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.